There's another driver out. The camera's pointing slightly to the left. So uh, we'll see how that pans out and we'll see you in a minute. So today we're going to go along the top road here to San Agino. Or as they say, San Uinio. But I think it's called San Agino. As in G is urgente. Urgent. We're going to stay on the left lane here for a while. But I'm actually going to nip over right to go straight ahead down towards Puerto Colón. Lots of red going on over there. Oh, it's a sail. <laughs> Guys, going. Will you miss my love? All the good I don't know if you can see the guy coming down in the paraglider. He's probably got one of them engines on at the back. Will you miss me and my love, my love, my love? So we're coming down Phil to Puerto Colón. The police don't stop me. Oh, they're stopping people without masks, that's what it is. I got to spend with you. I have so much inside of me. I want to tell you something true. I've been missing you, love. Yeah, I've been missing you, love. All the good times that we had. I've been missing you, love. Up with the Cologne. They're getting very, uh, what's the word? Uh, very particular in the next 14 days about the masks. It's an emergency situation. And they've been told to clamp way down because if we don't get out of the 14 day average uh, that's keeping us red, then there's going to be repercussions. So let's have a see what's open here. So I'm hoping the camera will pick it up. Looks like the first one's open. That's the, the sands. And tapas grills open, supermarkets closed, Taste of Italy's closed. And the corner is open, Gran Paiera Valencia. That's not too bad. So, not wearing masks. Oh, this is the Ovima Panoramica. A couple of friends stay here. And they say it's really good, right by the thick of it, and just around the corner from a dirt cheap bar. Doing a dollar a pint. So, we're coming up now to the San Agino shopping centre that I did a walk around the other time. And it used to be able to turn left here, but now you can only turn right. Not wearing a mask. There you go. So did I get her in slow motion, did I? way on a bike path. So is he. So Mara Phil's open. Star Bar's not open yet, but I believe it does open later on. And Bali High is open. I'm going to turn left here. There you go, give us a wave. And go to the right. 
we're going to go down the bottom and then uh, get down towards La Pinta. I hope the car noise isn't too buggy. I could maybe get it out using some sort of software. We'll see. So if you don't hear the car, I've either got a great mic or I was able to do it in post. Embassy's not open yet. Grandma son's not open yet. What else we got? Temple Bar Scotch Corner and Tinga, Tinga Tanga. That's new, is it? I've not heard that one before. Temple Bar is open. Live Sports Bar's closed. Hot Buffy's closed. Tipsy Turtle's open. Quite a few people there. They're definitely not two metres apart, though. And definitely not 50% capacity. I don't know how they get away with it, you know. And people like these, they probably just close up, so it's not worth it. Not worth opening, nobody around. And with the... Uh, what's it called? Restrictions, it's not worth opening. So that's open over there. That looks like it's open. Black sand excursions. This is the La Pinta. Just been reopened actually this year, I think, from a, a great refurb. The Bee Live. All the shops look closed. Some supermarkets. I don't know if the Bee Live's actually open. Doors are open. Restaurant Amanda, Victoria Steakhouse, some sort of karaoke. So, Hawaii is open. Taxi rank. So this is Pueblo Torviscus on the left, I think. Unique bar on the left and the other bar on the right. I don't I can't remember what it was called. Let's have a look down here. Shops on the right are closed. Maybe get a Sunday, I don't know. Fresh. They didn't say that's good. Good cocktails there. Well, Christina's parking space is taken. The disabled one. And this disabled one is taken twice. <laughs> See what we got here, Horizonte. We got the Hyatt, and this is restaurant is open. Pueblo Tovisca Sunset Harbour. Let's see what this looks like. Yeah, he's doing very well there. Very well done. Well done. Split it all out. Well done, Tanya's. So we're popping up now towards Fania Bay Plaza. If you go left down here to the car park, you come to the Moonlight Bar at the corner and the beginning of Fania Bay and Torviscus Beaches. So a woman's on the phone, not crossing on the crossing thing, so I'll just stop here. Shot to walk around me. There you go. Diamond International closed. I think that shop looks really closed. Might close down. They used to be like a tobacconist or something. So when it's open again, this gourmet market is a secret. It's a, a restaurant in there. It's to do with the hotel, but it's open to the public. People start up shut. These little stars, these shops on the right, say 50% are open. And the ATMs that charge you a fortune, don't use them. And these are closed. Jaffa Royale looks open. So does La Cabana. It was a show good. Okay, we can peer. Got lights on. 
La Flaca. That's where all the uh, workers go. Another slow motion. Ferreteria Baumami in Miami, not Mami. So I gotta give way here, but there's nobody coming. So off we toddle. So this is uh, Fania Bay Plaza. That's where all the buses meet, I suppose. Quite a bit open. The hotel in front of us, people have been asking. This is the best jacaranda. I wonder what the worst jacaranda looks like. Close. many people on this road, but uh, there's usually some. It's closed as well. Looks like they've knocked half that down. Must be refurbing. And this adults only hotel on the left here. I'm not going to turn left because uh, it's already five o'clock. Hotel in front of us is part of a group. Hotel Jardin de Navaria, and the other one of this group is in Playa Paraiso. Here you go. Girls getting the kit off. Or on, as the case may be. Five-star hotel. I heard some people have been uh, rehoused here. This is the Antilia. It's really nice. Don't know whether you could afford a beer in the bar, though. Yeah. So, Del Duc. Plaza Del Duc is actually closed, the whole thing. Does that mean I can't park there? No quiero oh dear. Parking's closed as well. I'll wait here for the guy to go around. So he can have a look. Well, that's where I was going to park. Completo. I don't believe it. That means full, complete. And in front of you is the new Victoria Hall relatively new Victoria and the street there's called Bischofshofen which is a great uh, beer, German beer and Grand Takandi, all the hotels around here are really really posh, really nice but as I say you probably pay $23 for a speciality gin in there let's have a turn right down here, although it's a dead end we'll have to turn round Let's see what's going on. People crossing. There you go. Off you go. Stick your mask on. Oh. All the chins are safe. She's not even bothering. They're not even bothering. Shame, really. We got 14 days to pull our socks up, and uh, we're not bothering. What a shame. So I could park here, but they don't take the card. Really, they're empty and desolate. Queen Victoria's house. Oh, what, what do you say is? Not Queen Victoria, what's her name? Liz Taylor, totally not true. It's owned by the Puig family. People that own, uh, what's it called, one, two, and three? Can't remember his name. Thank you. So, she finished being sick over the balcony, is she? Get your masks on. Okay. 
nip up here. Get in front of the taxi. We'll have a drive up past the Gran Tacandi. They've done that road nice as well. Because uh, they dug it all up a couple of years ago and then they decided to sort off, pedestrianise it. So that's quite good. If we go right in here, you see it changes. It's a sort of pedestrian zone. Tennis with himself. So as you can see, they think the whole thing's a crossing, which it probably is. And a lot more parking now on the left. It used to be straight parking on both sides, and it used to be two way. So now it's one way and a chevron parking on the left. You get a lot more people, a lot more cars parked. So Terrassa's Del Ducking right in front of us. This is part private, part rented. Expensive to rent there, I think between 900 and 1200 euros. A month or last time I looked anyway. straight ahead here. Looks like they're having a refurb there with the Adeki Grand, so that's not open. But at least it'd be nice after you've done it. I'm going to get in the left-hand lane in. Market's not been on for a while, which is a shame because these shops Del Duck used to do a killing on that day. There's all these restaurants on the left here. Three big ones upstairs couple of cafe type things downstairs. I'm going to turn right round. So Fanny Bay, Hotel Fanny Bay on the right and GF Isabel on the left. Right in front of you now. We come back round to Dill Duck Shops. Like a mirror in the distance there. Well, there you go, that's a nice view of Las Americas and Costa Adeje. And the sun's just coming out, what a fantastic view. Posh Hotel on the left here. I don't know whether it's open or not. That's where all the celebrities stay. All the staff have got to sign a non-disclosure agreement that they won't tell people who stayed there. I don't know whether they sign a non-disclosure agreement to say they've signed a non-disclosure agreement. But there we go. All these shops on the right. Sort of started getting okay just before the pandemic, so I don't think they've done very well. Twenty Twenty Grill and Tiggy's Bar still going. Unless somebody else has taken over, just kept the name. Looks like they're all having a smoke on there. Oh, there you go. Don't meet in big crowds. I mean, I don't blame the people, you know, because they don't see the effects here. They think, you know, they're probably going to be safe and there's hardly any people got it here, so. But, uh, you've basically got to just follow the rules for 14 days and then the numbers will go down, then we do what the hell we like. So I'm not going to go left here, I'm going to go straight on. I'll have a quick drive through La Caleta and then I'm going
going to finish it and go the back road home. In fact, I'll take you on the back road home and I'll turn it off at the supermarket, the two tree ball. Because I don't want to do too much footage. Sweets. They actually said they were going to uh, pay for the tests when they got here. I don't know what's going to happen now after the 23rd. So this is Playa de la Ramada. Uh, waiting for the sunset there. disabled it and they've taken it away. That's not good. So now we're coming up to Lagato. On the right. houses here in La Caleta. This street's nearly finished. They've sort of done it, but they haven't finished it yet. Boom bar and brunch. Oh, 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 oh. La Vieja's closed. Looks like it's closed for a bit. The scene is closed. We're going to go over here. Get in. Get in. One way, one time round. The Toluca we nearly rented a place on the right there, up on the hills. But that was going to be 1200. I'm glad we got one for 650. So I'm going to go down here. The Apnea Academy. Apnea is like sleep apnea where you stop breathing at night. I've had that. I had a machine that blew air up my nose. So the locale's open, the coffee cafe's open. James's place is open. The restaurant Rincon is open. to the top and have a stop and then I'll finish it here I think. So here's another look of Coral Hotels. There's two there. One's Coral Suites, one's Coral Hotel. Both I think are adults only. Correct me if I'm wrong. Maybe just one of them. There was a spa there. Oh, spa spotters. Got to get my uh, a picture of me there. I'll do it another day, though. And here we are, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not going to park in this disabled spot. I'm just going to go in so you can have a look. Good. 
so we'll find a place to park up and stop the camera. Unless it's run out of batteries, of course, which then, of course, you won't see anything. So just cross your fingers. Because the files are pretty big. So we're going to go left here. The place on the left is where they have the fairground in, like a letter. Once or twice a year. Get them, get them. Nice when they've finished doing the what's it calls. See if we can get on here before these guys come around. Yes, I can. Take a left. So if you want to rent something, you can rent in there. show you up here. Normally I'd take a right to go to the autobahn, but now we're going to take a right up here to the Via Maria. Sports centre on the left. Famous Via Maria or Villa Maria. But as we all know, double L is Y in Spain. Looks like it's open as well. to do this, they tend to build the roads first and then the buildings afterwards. So these obviously got built as roads and then the buildings never got built. Ah, might be a good place for a dog in here. <laughs> Walking your dog, I mean. Walking your dog. There we got some posh houses. houses, but they're probably for sale. Let's have a look in here. It's a dead end, I think. Yes, it is. So we're going to take a tour around here. Oh, now you go to more houses. roundabout. And you'll be able to see the sunset. Like a mirror. Americas and Costa Rica. <laughs> Give us a wave, girls. Give me the mouth open. 
Find a spot. Well, that's going to be it for now. So I hope we everything's going. Let's see if it's still running. Yes, it is. Looks like we did well. It's still warm here now, it's probably about 26 degrees and very, very humid. You know, you can you can smell the, the humidity. And uh, I'll just take you and show you over the edge. Here we go. So it's the view of the coral suites and La Coletta from the back there. Go left, you've got the Playa de Andramada and the H10, Sheraton La Coletta, the Rui or the Rio, I can never remember, and then Costa Adeki starts, Del Duc, and all the way around to Las Americas, the corner over there. Everywhere I've lived in my life, there's always been a hill that looks like an elephant, it's Plaza, Del Conde. Very peaceful on top of the golf course. Top of the golf course to here. I washed the car. <laughs> so I'm actually not going to do a walk around now. I'm going to go home. So, this is Tim. Believe me, they're messing Tenerife. Signing off. Bye.